Tyler. Wait, you don't know me. You still Stormy. arguing with a man you've been divorced for for three years. Follow Miss Maddie. Please stop. No, no, no. Because I heard. I did not. Please repeat it. No. No. Please repeat it. She's a demon. Hi ladies, my name is Claudine, also known as Glam Rocks. Here we will share laughs, achievements, disappointments, but most importantly, we will grow and glow together. I look forward to creating a safe environment here for all women. Please like and subscribe on the road to 1000 house rules. Every statement is in my opinion, and this is for entertainment purposes only. Respect everyone's opinion, but don't be rude because I will block you. Let's get into this. Hi ladies, good morning. So, I don't know where it's at, where you at, but good night, good morning, it's 6 a.m. here. <laughs> so, I was sitting here, I was actually sleeping, and I woke up and I saw some disturbing messages on my comments section uh, from two ladies. Basically, one and the other ones commented, uh, comment to her. I block one, I hope I did it correctly, and the other one is still lurking around. I, I want... Let me understand this. You are grown women, because I looked at your pictures, y'all, my age group in your 40s, who hate male for what? For what? Like Betty Kruger. Y'all look like that. For what? Why do y'all hate someone who left a situation like that? So today I want to talk about when demons lurk. Have you ever been considered the black sheep in your family? The person that doesn't just go along to get along? The person who thinks for themselves? Hi, <laughs> we need to start a support group. My name is Claudine, also known as Glam Rocks. And I looked at these women. I'm like, why do you hate Mel? Before Melometers was started and all of that, I, I'm not a person that care um, to say I'm a millimeter, but I'm a, I'm a hundred percent full of male. Uh, I support male in everything that she does because you know what? I could see my younger self in my well late twenties to mid thirties. I was male. So these grown women. From your 40s to your 60s and 70s, y'all hate male, why? Why? This is the reason some of your daughters are scared to come and sons are scared to come to you and say, your boyfriend touched me. You have so much hate and anger inside of you. That's why you're not good Judy's. You're not good friends. You're not someone that someone can talk to and come to. You, you, you need to check. The hate in your heart. Then I'm like, you know what? <laughs> I see why Mel has this to carry on her shoulders and why God is going to bring her through. They even did it to him. They denied him in his face. They denied him behind his back until he was crucified for not getting along to get along. So when demons lurk. So this young lady, Aaron Curry, um, decided that I'm going to sleep with this man. I don't know when the situation started to where she decided to stay with him because she did do some sort of interview to where she was trying to date somebody else and Martel was not having it. How dare his side chick try to leave him? How dare she try to leave him. Now, this girl mind is so wrapped up in this married man that she don't know what the front to back what it is. Now, I just recently posted a video, my last video, about um, them possibly being married. Now, in the state of Alabama, they could be married because all you need is a contractual agreement now. And if you don't file that contractual agreement that was notarized with the state of Alabama with the state so it can be recognized by the state, they still married. Now, how does them being married benefit Martel? It benefits him zero. How does it benefit Ariane? 
she gets to come out and say, that's my husband. That's my man. Look at the life that she has. She said, let me go cook for my man. Oh, and then he, he was in the background talking about she should be happy. And she said, you should be happy too. From there, I didn't think they were married, but I knew he made some sort of promise to her like he always does. And says, I, I'm not trying to be funny, y'all, but I think Ariane is just, have, may have some cognitive delay. I'm not trying to be funny. I've been around these YouTube streets for nine years, and I just literally started making commentary. But I watch everything. I watch everything. I pay attention. Now, it's the same reason why would a man leave a woman that allows him to cheat and always takes him back? Why? He has convenient cigs. He has convenient meals. And he could just say, I'm sorry, and come back. Now, when demons lurk, because this girl started this attack, well, Martel started this attack, she joined. She's more obsessed with Mel than he is now. Because her journey and her life goal is to let's bring down Mel. Let's show she's not the nice person that she shows the world that she is. Why y'all hate her so much, though? I want to know, these grown women in my age group in your 40s, 50s, and 60s, I don't look like y'all because I'm going to look 60 and I'm going to look 40. Y'all y'all look like Betty Krugers for real. Y'all have so much hate. Y'all look like demons. Just demonic spirits. Then you got Letitia, mama hate. Letitia started hating Mel so bad that her mama started hating Mel just as the same. And now, Betty Kruger was on there. Y'all saw how she was acting? That was not only for her. That was for Betty. That was for all the mamas that hate Mel. Y'all didn't see a demon come out that lady? Yeah, did y'all not see a demon come off that? Did y'all see how she was going off at Mel and she threw herself back and went, like, dick, dick, like, what the heck? Have y'all ever, have you, if you never, I seen it, a demon come out of a person, that's how she looked. Like that other word, if I could believe in God, I could believe that demons exist. And I know they do. Because those right there are demonic spirits. And this is why we need to keep Mel lifted up in prayer and her children. Because Martel just sat on that show and said, them kids okay with his mistress. That's another reason why he keep her around. Y'all wait till Martel find a woman he really wants to be with. That has class, sophistication. Uh, male 2.0. Y'all see how fast he run away from that girl. And y'all gonna see that girl on the news or TV spilling it. Okay? She's gonna be spilling everything. If he think he got charges now, Ariane hold the skeletons to all those men on the show. Sitting up there, except for Carlos. Carlos don't pay her two damn cents. And she mad about that. But anyway, when demons lurk, y'all get y'all got to stay prayed up. Because I can't understand why these grown women so upset with Mel. This is why your daughters, your cousins, your neighbors, women. Well, I'm a woman's woman. A girl's girl. They can't come to y'all and talk to y'all. Y'all have so much hate. Y'all know why? If you follow me on TikTok at Glam Rocks, you'll see I'm always, because I'm in the medical field, talking about nurses with a purse. My colleagues, and all they do is take care of me for love. Don't want them. <laughs> oh, Lord, let me not start. But y'all know, y'all know why y'all mad? Y'all in these country hickory ta damn towns. Y'all stuck with a man that always cheated. Have five, of, five to six kids running around. Every time they go to, to the school, you see a child that looks like your son or your daughter. Every time you go to the grocery store, to the gas station, you see his mistress. Money coming out your house left and right, and now he probably sick, and now you're stuck taking care of him. Mm -hmm. Well, do what you do. <laughs> do what you do, demons. Uh, but on this side, we'll be praying Mel up, because we've been through the same situation. And guess what? L look at us. We're glowing and growing. Join the tribe and get the hate out your heart. But anyway, ladies, leave a comment below. Let's talk about it. Have demons ever lurked that people that you thought was your friends or family members that you thought was on your side and then they were exposed 
for not liking you. And still to this day, you don't know why. I I heard here for hot tea say, if you have a problem with me, you're going to have a problem with me forever. I'm a little different. If you got a problem with me, I don't care. <laughs> One thing, I don't know if because I'm a chorus, I know how to ignore people. I have some family members I'll probably just never speak to. I'll say hello when I walk in the room because I'll raise right. But we'll probably never speak. I will make you forget you was even birth. That's how bad I would ignore you in the room, even if it was just us two. But anyway, drop down in the comments. Talk to you ladies later.